Well, hello, good afternoon, everybody. We should be uh, up and away in a few moments with our coverage, which I'm sure will be a fascinating game. There is an added sense of drama provided by the elements, actually. The rain has once more decided to appear at this most inopportune of moments, and it is heavy rain. It does not dampen the atmosphere. The turnout here is good. The noise is very good. It remains colourful, but it could be a problem for the players because the pitch might very quickly turn heavy. We'll see as it all plays out over the next couple of hours here. The ultra-modern home of Arsenal, a symbol of their class, their timeless sophistication. According to what we've been told, this is how it looks. It's a 4-3-3. Well, one of the attacking advantages in this setup, Peter, is the impact that can be made between fullbacks and the attacking wide players. These combinations, when worked well, can be a real handful for any opposition. And we're likely to witness that again. You often see the wide man drift inside to allow the fullback to make the run out wide. And it can just throw the opposition off kilter. We have already started here. Who do you think this turns on, Jim? Yeah, Jordan Pickford. He's a great all-round goalkeeper, Peter. Uh, great at shot stopping and dominant in his box. He also gets counter-attacks going with his accurate long passes. The opposition should be a little wary of committing too many men forward to attack because if it does break... Is that a foul? Yes, the uh, referee's given it. Calvert Lewin. Gabriel Jesus. Nelson. Good clearance and very necessary. That was good pressing. Forced the error to. Well, that looks a foul. Yep, referee's given it. He can't say now that he hasn't been warned. Well, he knew what he was taking on there, Peter, and special delivery from the ref. Nelson. Gabriel Jesus. Gabriel Jesus. Townsend. Coleman tries to get it forward quickly. Great strength, too strong for his opponent. Yeah, that does look a foul. Referee's given a free kick. And that has been cleared. Forward it goes. Gabriel Jesus. Just lacked a decent finish. Yeah, on another occasion, all that went wrong may come right. Everton have opted to really stretch the game now. And Josh Townsend has got himself a free kick. Partey is being told in no uncertain terms that this will be his final warning. Yeah, and he has to change his ways or this referee could soon change his status. Coleman positions himself well and cuts it out. Well, I don't think it was the wisest option, Peter, once he got into that position. It's not as if he didn't have people nearby. 
Allen. He's pulled him up for that challenge. Calvert Lewin. It's Calvert Lewin! And that certainly packs a punch. Gabriel Jesus. Tries to locate someone up front. Iwobi plays it out to the flank. Going through, and he's managed to beat absolutely everyone. Holding, looking cross field, changing the point of attack. If you have just joined us, well, you've missed no goals. Alan with a good steal, well played. Wobi, Allen, Gabriel Jesus gets it back. Oh, they could break here. Gabriel Jesus and the shot. Looks to bypass the midfield. Tate. Gabriel Jesus. Oh, that's a fine challenge. Keeper sends it forward. Over to the left. He's got options out wide. That's great strength on the ball. It's a very good battle there, terrific to watch. Close for goal! And he's done it! On the cusp of half-time, he delivers with perfect timing. All over in seconds, that's what they can do to you. Well, talking about being hit on the break, the ball was in their net before they could even organise their defence. It was fast and furious, and all but unstoppable. Deadlock broken, it's 1-0. And that ought to be the trigger for a really exciting and entertaining game from here on. Partey. Has a hit! Oh, denied brilliantly! Well, you can't ask for much more than that. A difficult moment he simply had to deal with. Chances keep on coming, they're awarded another corner. Massive leap! Away from immediate danger. Went with his head, but couldn't steer it in. Oh, I'm not sure what he had in mind, and I don't think he knew either. Gets wrestled off the ball. Tierney. Just brushed off the ball there. And the referee brings the 
first half to a close. And here we are, off they go for half time. The breakthrough did indeed come in the first half, but there has only been that one goal, which is very, very tight. It's the first half compared with your expectation. A lead that's fully justified for me. They've shown some excellent counter attacking now, so it's paying dividends. Leading a cagey game here. It's had its moments, and it's 1 0 at the break. And the game has already resumed here. Well, it's been tight, Peter, but I'm expecting things to, to open. Going for goal! It's in! Two up now, and they are cruising. The keeper deserves some sympathy there. He may not have seen that until too late. So that's two now without reply. Well, at 1-0, this contest was still nicely poised, but now that it's gone to two, mindsets are affected a lot more. Winning belief one way and that losing feeling the other. More than happy to take the muscular approach. Forward tracking back like that, always appreciated by the crowd. You have to admire commitment like that because he could easily ignore that and just kind of walk around and let others do all the chasing but instead he looks as if he relishes the chance to uh, to dig in for his team here that's the throw townsend referee's given a throw Partey, Granit Xhaka, Everton uh, keeping their men at arm's length here. Yeah, I just think it's a, a conservative move to deny runners the opportunity of, of going beyond that rear guard. Gabriel Jesus, Gabriel Jesus finds himself offside. Pickford sends that a long way. Holding. It's always a good time to register and, and lay down a, an early marker in the second half. They clearly had exactly that in mind and have gone about their business with absolutely the right commitment. Battles to win it back. Well, the ball's come loose and the chase is on. Well, that's pretty clear. It is a foul. And he has shown him a yellow card. Well, the players are making their point, but the ref clearly isn't interested. He's waved them all away. Bit from an unexpected source. I think it's great to see that kind of application and desire from a forward who wants to help out his defence. I, I think, you know, any good team really, your striker should be the first line of that defence, and, and he's delivering. Pass needed to be better than that, and he knows it. Alan tries to switch the play. Townsend. Oh, the defence got the better of him this time, but I'm sure he'll go again. 
Ducore. And here's Townsend. Ducore. He's found his man. Keane does well to read it and intercepts. Pickford gets it upfield. Gabriel Jesus. Uh, ball needed to be better there. It's a wasted chance. Hoists it forward. And it's Allen. That always looked inevitable. The defence dealt with that really well. And it's been taken straight back. And back to base. Leading by two, and the finishing line in sight. Gabriel Jesus. And that has been clubbed away. Coleman. Coleman plays it forward. Breaks on here. Keane simply had to make that count, and he did it with some authority too. Wonderful. Alan drives it forward. <laughs> so that's it. It is all over. So they bask in their win. Genuinely professional performance and the result, which is well deserved. Can you sum up what we've witnessed, Jim? Yeah, they had a game plan which was about hammering away in central positions, and it paid off. For me, they were persistent and ruthless. This remains for me to thank Jim Beglin for joining us and to wish.